Aloha, I am Bishop Larry Silva, the Bishop of the Diocese of Honolulu, which includes all of the Hawaiian Islands. It is good to be with you here, and we uh, know that uh, life is precious. God has given us the gift of life, and uh, he wants us always to value that gift and to be thankful for it. We know that suicide is always tragic, that very often uh, people have uh, hurts and uh, muddled uh, feelings and uh, they just don't know where to go and what to do and so they think the only way out is suicide. We have uh, spent many, many resources trying to prevent suicides and yet on January 1st, 2019, the state of Hawaii will permit uh, people to commit suicide. Now it's not going to be called suicide because suicide is bad, uh, but it really is the same reality. Uh, and it is only for people who are in their uh, right mind, shall we say, who are certifiably uh, able to make this decision without depression, and yet who still decide to uh, take a medication that will end their lives. We pray that no one will do this because it is a kind of short-circuiting the way that God intended for us to live and to die. Very often we are afraid, of course, at the time of death when we have a serious illness. Very often we might feel that we are a burden to others. We might feel helpless because we're not able to do the things that we are normally uh, able of doing to do for ourselves uh, and yet um, it is also an opportunity to allow others to love you in a very different way. I recall a friend of mine who was dying of AIDS and um, he said at one point that this was the greatest blessing that God had given him because not of the disease, but because it allowed him to understand how much people loved him. And so we hope that people will not short circuit this dying process. That yes, they will take whatever medication is available to alleviate the pain. And there are many uh, palliative uh, solutions available that can help one uh, out of pain, uh, but we pray that it will be a time to be with loved ones, to reflect on the value of life and the value of eternal life, hoping that we will be able to enter into that peace of God's kingdom forever. We pray for all of those who are suffering, who are sick, and we surround them with our love. Mahalo.